Good morning, guys. I'm just checking in with you this morning just to let you kind of see what I've been doing this morning or hear about what I've been doing this morning. Um, this morning I went and walked. My daughter has summer school um, for the next three weeks. And um, so I went and walked on the junior high track while she was in summer school. It's about an hour, hour. She goes from 8.30 to um, 10. So I walked from about 8.30 to 10. Um, I was so disappointed because I so wanted to get my 10,000 steps in um, in that time frame, and I did not. I got 8,700 and what, 40, 43, something like that. So I was a little disappointed that I did not get my 10,000 steps in when I was walking. Um, but I had to go to the store afterwards, so I got my 10,000 in when I got to the store. So now everything after this is bonus. Bonus. Um, so I got that done already this morning. I ran to the store and picked up the things that I needed. I saw this recipe online for what is it? A um, um, I'll tell you what it is here. It is a lemon dill egg salad, but it has no egg in it. Um, because of this diet that I'm following, um, I'm not really allowed too much of the egg. Um, I'm not allowed the, it calls for mayonnaise, vegan mayonnaise. Um, I'm not really allowed the mayonnaise either. I got some light mayonnaise. Um, I might have to be kind of light with that. Um, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to, it's, it's got chickpeas and kidney beans in there. Capers, I've never had caper before, so this is going to be something totally different for me. Um, or turmeric. I don't know that I've ever had turmeric. I know I bought it because I didn't. Look at, I was going to, look at this. Do you see this, Mark? This is from, this is from my walk this morning. Um, <clears throat> my phone, I've got a really large Apple Plus phone. Um, it's from the band that, you know, the, the thing that holds your, your phone <laughs> that I walk with. Um, I guess when I walk my fingers, my fingers swell really bad. So apparently this swells too, I would assume, because it really, it started to hurt when I was walking and, but the problem is if I would have loosened it up, it would have fell off. Uh, so I just let it go and I take it off. I'm like, that's why it hurt. Oh, battle, battle scars are ready today. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try this, this eggless chicken salad and see how it goes. I'm going to go jump in the shower and make my lunch. I'm really excited about not so much the egg eggless salad part of it. I'm more looking forward to the fresh tomato and the sprouts that I got and the lettuce that goes on it. I, I love sprouts for some reason. Tomatoes, it's it's August. So the tomatoes are really fresh right now. It's really refreshing. The temperature today is going to be 90 some, 92 degrees I think today. Um, today is also an ozone action day for me here. I live in, in Michigan. Um, I live, you can tell I'm from Michigan, right? Because I live down here. You know and how it wraps around the bottom of the lake. I live right here. So the humidity can get really bad um, here. Uh, so it's going to be 90, 92 degrees today. I got my walk in, like I said before, the 90 degrees. It was like 70 something in my walk, but it was still it was hot. Um, yeah, it's, it's 83 right now. Uh, it feels like 86 out because of the humidity. So I wanted to get that in before that ozone action day. The, the air gets really thick and they said it's hard to breathe. Um, I want to get it done before it got hot. So I'll check it back in with you later and let you know how, how my sandwich, how my eggless sandwich went. Okay, so it's lunchtime, and I obviously um, got myself all cleaned up, and I made my lunch, so I wanted to share it with you. Um, I saw this recipe one day on YouTube. Um, I enjoy watching High Carb Hannah, so when I watch her videos, um, a lot of other videos will pop up, and this came off of, um, the recipe is by Health Nut Nutrition. Um, she was in the kitchen with Edgy Veg Kitchen, apparently, um, and the title of it is Easy Vegan Lunch Ideas. So this um, recipe, I left one thing out, and that was the mayonnaise. Um, I put the chickpeas in the white beans. Um, it has um, 
turmeric in it, salt and pepper, lemon juice, um, capers. I, like I said before, I've never had capers before. Um, so this was very easy to make. It just goes right into your food processor and you pulse it together until it starts to come together. Um, paprika too. Next time I might try smoked paprika in this. Um, and then I put it on some bread with lettuce and sprouts and tomatoes. And to be quite honest with you, the sandwich looks fabulous. So I'm going to share this with you here. I want you to see this sandwich. And again, this is supposed to be an egg salad sandwich and it has no egg in it. But look at that sandwich. Isn't that beautiful? That is just, that is a beautiful, and it looks like eggs. It looks like an egg salad. So we're going to go ahead and try this here. I'm going to do this with you on camera. How brave am I to eat with you watching, right? So we're going to try. Oh, and it's on sourdough. Um, it is an organic um, sourdough bread. I don't have it in front of me, or I'd show you that too, but I don't have it. So. Mm hmm mm hmm That's a good sandwich. You kind of get, I can taste the capers in it. It kind of reminds me of um, like a dill pickle, almost kind of. More vinegar than anything. But I am a sprouts girl. I love sprouts. So this is, this is a hit for me. I would take this to work with me. Uh, I would eat this for dinner. Very good sandwich. The other thing, the other new thing I found today when I was at the store picking, because I didn't have beans with me, so I had to go to the store and turmeric either, which it's fine. It's fabulous. Love the turmeric. I smelled it. It smells good, too. So I didn't mind putting that in there. But like I said, the only thing I left out was the mayonnaise. I, I don't miss the mayonnaise. I'm sure with the mayonnaise, it would be a little bit more creamier. But I don't miss it. Anyway, what else I found that I'm going to try today was agua fresca, watermelon, ginger, lime juice. Now, it's a fruit drink with natural flavors, nothing artificial. It says light and refreshing. Um, I am not a pop drinker anymore. I've given that up completely. Um, I'm, I'm a big water drinker. This was just something I saw. The, the, the bottle caught my eye. It, there's many flavors to these. But like I said, the the bottle caught my eye, so I was very curious, and I had to try it. Um, I can show you this here, too, if that helps. I don't know if you can read that or not. Um, but it doesn't look horrible. Um, watermelon, ginger, lime on a refreshing hot day outside, like I said. I think I was worth a try, so we're going to try this, too. That's interesting. Um, that's not bad. That, that is not bad. We, here in the little town that we're in, in Michigan, we don't have a lot of these neat things like this. So that, that's new to me as well. Um, I enjoy it. So I'm going to finish my lunch and, um, I will check back in with you later. Okay, so it is about... Five minutes to five um, and I will show you what's going on in this house wave hi that's Marissa she is um, cooking um, rice at the moment um, she just got done making some sloppy Joe's um, and I am making my husband some ribs um, he is very much a meat eater um, so I'm making that and um, some corn on the cob and some steamed green beans, some fresh green beans that I found today at, at the store. Um, I think for dinner, I think I'm just going to have another um, eggless sandwich. And then my other daughter is over here in the living room. She was doing Legos and now she's watching um, videos on YouTube. So at some point, I am looking for a camera because um, right now I'm doing all this recording and things on my laptop. 
um, I'm looking for something to do this so I can take you mobile because tonight we might actually be taking the boat out on Lake Michigan and I would love to show you some things going on out there. So I'm really hunting and deciding on what I want to purchase for that. Um, so I probably will check in with you later yet again tonight because I was watching one of Hannah's videos today and she made a banana ice cream, which I've had banana ice cream before and it's not bad. Um, she made a banana peanut butter ice cream. Um, I'm not a big banana fan, but just just the chocolate banana peanut butter. She put chocolate banana peanut butter and then pumpkin seeds in there. Um, I don't have any pumpkin seeds, so I'll have to leave those out. Um, and the cocoa nibs. I don't I don't know if I have any of those either, but. Um, Definitely, I have some frozen bananas in the freezer right now because I was putting them in my oatmeal. Um, so I probably, more than likely tonight, would be making that banana chocolate peanut butter. So I will check back in with you soon. Good morning. I just wanted to finish up my video um, on the tail end of it. We got home pretty late last night from the lake. Um, so I was not able to get my videos of the lake off of my daughter's iPod. For some reason, my phone won't hold a video. Um, it says it doesn't have enough storage. I have plenty of storage. I don't understand that, all that storage stuff. Anyway, um, I, like I said before, I am looking to get a camcorder or like a GoPro so I can take some uh, footage other than doing this on my laptop. Um, so I just want to finish this video up. I did have uh, the peanut butter chocolate banana ice cream last night, but I didn't show a picture of it because uh, I had one banana instead of two, and um, it was a little runny, so it was more like soup, banana, chocolate, peanut butter ice cream, but it was still good. I still ate it. I didn't care. I could have drank it with a straw, but I used a spoon, um, So, but it was still good, so um, this morning I have already been and done my four miles. Um, I need to take a shower and I need to start on my day number two, even though I'm finishing up day number one. So I just want to touch base with you. And if you liked my video, hit like, subscribe to me so you can keep up with what I do. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.